Welcome to Lockheed Martin and Sikorsky Aircraft. My name is Sean Maloney, one of the test pilots here at Sikorsky, and I'd like to introduce you to the CH-53K King Stallion. At first glance, the 53K may look like its predecessor, the 53E Super Stallion, but it's the beneficiary of decades of lessons learned that make the aircraft safer, easier to maintain, and more survivable. 53K features an aerial refueling probe for advanced mission range. The muscle behind the King Stallion are its three T408 GE engines, capable of producing over 7,500 shaft horsepower each, providing real-time power available information to the pilots in the cockpits and integrating with our fly-by-wire flight control system for increased situational awareness and safety in any environment. The backbone of the King Stallion is a split torque main gearbox capable of handling over 19,000 shaft horsepower, able to lift a weight of 88,000 pounds and accommodating up to a 36,000 pound external load. The gearbox transmits that power up through our massive titanium rotor head and into our seven wide core main rotor blades. The 53K is made of a composite airframe, large cockpit transparencies for a field of view, large cabin windows for crew serve weapons and emergency egress, and integrated fuel sponsors. The King Stallion's full authority flight control system dramatically reduces pilot workload. The tactile cueing allows the pilots to maintain eyes outside the cockpit for improved situational awareness. The King Stallion's wide cabin area allows up to 30 Marines in crash attenuating seats along the bulkheads or reconfigure into litter configuration for casualty evacuation and also contains the ability to carry extended range fuel tanks inside the cabin. The increased maintainability of the 53K comes a lot from all the sensors that are on the aircraft. They feed into the integrated vehicle health usage monitoring system that provides increased awareness to the maintenance department. The CS53K is in production now and being flown by the Marine Corps today providing an increased leap in technology and increased survivability and maintainability to the fleet.